So, you know, when you're drawing characters, characters are really easy to draw. A lot of people think, oh, it's so hard to come up with characters. But they're really super easy. Um, so I will show you guys how I, I decided on how to draw some of these characters, okay? So the first thing you want to do when you draw your characters is draw what you love, okay? Uh, you'll have a hard time drawing what you hate to draw. And so, for example, I love drawing ninjas. Uh, that's just my favorite thing. I love drawing robots. Robots are great to draw. When I draw my characters, I always start with the head. And so I always start with a circle for the head, okay? And this circle might not be a circle uh, after a while, but I always want to start and just basically that circle will locate where this person is, okay? Then I start with the body. Now you can do as many different shapes for the body as you want. The body could be a round shape, like a teardrop, or it could be a circle, or it could be a square. So for my ninja girl, I decided to make her a square. Okay, and I'm going to make her kind of relaxed standing, so I'm going to have her, her, the square kind of bent. If you have her square kind of straight, she'll stand up like straight like this. But if you have the square bent or, uh, or back or forth, then she'll be more relaxed. So I'm going to make her kind of a relaxed drawing. And wherever the, 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 the square is bent, the other square for her, their feet is bent the other way. So for example, this leg here is going to be bent down like this, like an S. Okay, and then this will be her feet. Okay, and then I just, uh, next thing I do is I attach the arm, and I like to just kind of let, for this relaxed form, I'm just going to let it hang down a little bit, and maybe this hand right here. When you draw stick figures, make sure that they all have shoulders, okay, because a lot of times we draw stick figures, they have no shoulders. Your arms just come from the neck, and that's not good. Your arm, you have to have a shoulder, and you also have to have a waist, okay, so make sure that you guys have each one of those when you draw your stick figures. Once I draw my stick figures, I can go ahead and continue drawing all the, all the little details. So she's a ninja, so I'm going to go ahead and just draw her, her, um, her visor here, okay? And I always draw eyes as dots. You can draw eyes in any way you want, but I like to draw dots. So you guys might be like, wait, Mr. Fam, if I was drawing just eyes as dots, how can I show that she's scared or confused or mad? How can I show that? And you don't even have any mouth. How can you show that she's sad? Well, with the eyes, the easiest way to make any type of emotion is just to use the eyebrows, okay? So if she's confused or, um, or, uh, or sad, her eyebrows will go up like this. See that? Sad ninja. Okay, eyebrows up. Now, if she was mad, let me use my eraser here. If she was a mad ninja, then her eyebrows would be angled down like this. See that? Mad ninja. Okay, and if she's just a happy-go-lucky regular nin ninja mood, okay, she can just be like this, just like that. Okay, and one more emotion. What if she was like confused? Basically, if she's confused, she will have one that's normal and one that's mad. So she's like, "What? What? I don't know." All right. So I'm gonna have her like that. She's kind of confused, and then we'll just go ahead and draw in the details. She's going to be a girl ninja, and because she's all dressed up, I don't really know how I can make her look like a girl. I know. I'll have her have a ponytail. Then I'll draw her neck, okay, because we all have necks. Don't draw the neck too big. A lot of you guys like to draw necks like this, like it just goes into your body. The neck's always a lot smaller than you think. And then we're going to draw her arm. Because she has the ninja uniform on, okay, we're going to kind of just draw the details of a ninja. She's going to have a sash that goes like this. Okay, and then she's going to have a belt. Okay, and the belt's going to be tied. Okay, and then we're just going to tie it up like this. Now, ninjas are cool because they have these, these uh, gloves that aren't really gloves. They just go onto their hands. So that's what I'm going to draw right here, like this. And then her hands. Now, when you draw hands, people are so always like, oh, how do I draw hands? They're so hard. Here's the easy way. You guys ever have french fries? Just draw a french fry box. Every hand is like this. French fry box. Okay, French fries. Okay, and one French fry trying to escape. See that? French fry box, French fries, one French fry trying to escape the side. And there's the hand. Now, when I draw cartoons, I always draw just four fingers. You guys can draw five, you guys can draw three, whatever you like. But I only like the four finger cartoons. Now, all I gotta do now is draw her pants. It's gonna be easy. I'm just gonna. Draw in her pants here, draw in her feet, okay, and that's my character.
Uh, maybe I'll do some details, like maybe I'll do some hair, like this, just to have it in more detail. Um, and then, and that's it.